Today's video is going to be about how to edit a YouTube video you've uploaded. So you need to click on your icon on the top right and then click on your channel. And then once you've done that, click on YouTube Studio. This computer's going a bit slow today, sorry, you have to bear with me. I sometimes also use an editor called OpenShot, which is free, which lets you splice two videos together, which YouTube editor doesn't let you do. So once you're on your dashboard, click on videos on the left. Yeah, I think that OpenShot editor is also a good editor to use. I use that as well as the YouTube. It's free on the, on the App Store. So once you're on your videos, click on the thumbnail of the video you want to edit. And once you're on it, you can you put your title, things like your description. It's better to have a longer description. You can choose your thumbnail, which shows. You can also, is the video for kids? No, it's not. In this case, you can put age restriction on, but bear in mind, you, you, it's not monetized with age restriction. You, you won't get any money. Um, but to edit it, click on editor on the left. Come on, computer. Right, now, once we're on the editor, you can you can see there, you can trim the video, you can add audio, you can or you can trim your own audio, you can add actual YouTube audio, free songs, I'll show you that in a sec, but this bit's important, you can put a playlist and a subscribe on it, well, it'll pop up on your video, but and you can choose there when you want it to pop up, so I usually have them pop up for the last 10 seconds of the video because... You don't want to do the whole video because people just end up turning it off. It's just in the way of the video. And you can also blur faces out. So if, you, if you, it's a video of your family or, or etc, you can blur the faces out, which is really good. But this is how you get the, uh, the YouTube sounds on. So you can add or replace audio on your video. It's really good. So you can you can place it if it's you can replace over your own audio. Or you can add audio. There's just free songs and, and sound bites. There's, there's thousands of them, and you can search for something specific too. It's really good. So I use this editor along with OpenShot editor, um, and they're basically the two editors that I use.